I went back to Scotland and I wanted to show you these UFOs. I freeze framed a couple of them. Okay, and I zoomed in. I'm not going to do a lot on this, but I just wanted to show you what's up there. I mean, uh, these UFOs are just unreal. You know, so I'm trying to do more of this forensic stuff for you people because I'm getting a lot of requests. Um, you know, I'm all about Jesus, guys. UFOs, they're there, they're there. You know, I didn't believe in UFOs six months ago. I thought they were just a big hoax. So I woke up. Anyways, now I'm catching them like this. And these things are moving. I think this is uh, like a freeway through the Nordic, uh, Norway, Netherlands. I do catch quite a few UFOs up there. I have to go through my footage. But I'm going to get ready to show you something here of a UFO that I caught. I think I caught this thing three or four days ago. Uh, the one I'm going to show you. And I'm going to do a little forensic on it. And that will be the show, okay? So what I'm going to do is <clears throat> say hi here. And uh, you guys let me know comments about the forensic tool. And this UFO I'm going to show you is amazing. Anyways, I am going to put some, uh, some stuff on the end here, Planet X I caught. Uh, but I think the sunrise for Planet X sky, a sunrise in the south, is pretty amazing in Mexico, you know. Uh, or from Alaska, I mean. Anyways, I uh, hope you guys are going to have a good holiday. Um, a lot of people short on cash. And that's, you know, foreseeable because life goes on, right? So here we go. I just freeze frame that one. It's still the same type of orb with the orb behind it. And um, I, I would believe these would be drones, but they're going too fast. I had to slow this down quite a bit just to catch what I did and then freeze frame a, a few shots. And, um, you know, everybody's going, don't stop using the forensic. Don't stop doing the UFOs. Um, did you guys watch the last video where I caught on the uh, Bloom Sky cams, like two skies with double planets and crazy stuff? Anyways, uh, if you haven't watched those, go watch them. They'll be on the end cap on this thing. So here's some music, and I'll talk to you later. Merry Christmas. God bless. And I hope you guys have a great weekend, all right? And I got more videos coming. I'm running smooth right now. God bless my PC.
up the music. Okay, guys, was that not insane? Check this thing out. I mean, at first I thought, this is just a dark cloud. But when you really look at this thing, oh my God, especially on that one screen, it was kind of multicolored. Check it out.
This footage from yesterday is just pretty out of control. It's, uh, what would Seven say? I'm stuck. Look at this thing. I just keep changing different filters. It's obviously something there. It doesn't matter if it's a real planet or a UFO at this point. It could be a collective of UFOs making like a ball, uh, trying to distract. But really, if you watch underneath this right here, underneath this ball, um, I think I just picked up a few seconds ago. That right there is definitely an orb. It could be from the light reflection from the sun simulator up in the trees there. But it's definitely, you know, distinct. It's in the sky. It's solid. Whatever it is, planet, UFO, whatever it is, we're just digging out the deception that's going on, guys. And you know, I actually think um, <clears throat> right underneath that kind of egg-looking orb planet thing, um, there is actually, um, before I started talking before, there's actually a dark orb. I think that's a distraction. Um, a lot of people are going to say this is light lens reflection. It could be just all made up from hollow skies. I know some people are going to say those streaks of lines going through it are the fence. No, I don't know what I think about flat earth and the whole fence system and all that. I mean, I'm just, this is so much. I don't know if I could put something else as strange as flat earth on my plate. You know, I'm not saying I don't believe it. I'm just saying this is so much deception going on, guys. So anyways, I'm trying to bring you the best show. I think that that right there is some type of. UFO craft right there that blue thing um, you've seen it a couple different ways so I'm gonna change the picture here change the filter on it see it's pretty deceptive looks like it's a number of UFOs making clouds and it kind of looks like a planet but I don't know you know I'm debunking my own video from yesterday uh, I'm not really debunking it because I just showed it to you I didn't declare that it was planet X but that looked like a hand on top of a lens. Look at this, guys. It looks like one of those UFO hands, like on top of a lens. Ain't that insane looking? I mean, that's using the histogram. It's called histogram uh, contrast. Uh, but look at that. That's crazy looking. I mean, you know, my imagine. My wife says you got a great imagination. So that's what it looks like right there. But when you put that histogram on there, it brings out the different weird colors, and it. You know, this could all be just a hollow sky show. Some guy just, some alien or some guy just put a three finger, four finger hand on there. Look at that, guys. Um, that's just weird. <laughs> As Seven would say, he got me stuck on that one. This is that red ball underneath it. That's pretty trippy looking. So, um, you know, this shows what it is, guys. I'm, I'm insane. People say, you need to be committed. I am. I'm committed to Jesus Christ, my Lord and Savior, 100%. Now look at this. I'm not exaggerating this. I'm not going to say what I think it, it looks like. Okay, whoever can see this, I'm just going to like end the show with this. And I want you to, what face do you see with what kind of thing is on his head? Come on. So I'll give you a clue at the end of the video. Stick around. It's almost over. There. That right there. Whose face is that, guys? Okay, just keep watching. And I'm not doing no Photoshop. This is real. To me, that looks just like the face with the crown on it of Jesus Christ. You're safe in Jesus' name. You have a good one, folks. I'll see you in the next video. Mars. Bye.
Bye.